Today is day three, our final Disney day. Oh my goodness, I can't believe how fast it's gone. But also, I'm like, it's gone fast, but then it hasn't. I don't know. That's a bit of a weird statement to make. Anyway, we're checking out this morning of our room. It's done and served its purpose well, but we are heading to our Airbnb this evening. So what we're doing is Ryan started to take some bits to the car. We're going to check out here. Then we're going to walk over to IHOP, I think, for some food. I'm very excited for that. I really, really love some pancakes. And then we're going to have our final Disney day. So we're going to be park hopping between the two parks and having like the best time ever. So I can't wait for that. Do, 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 do. Come here. How hot is it? Super hot. Very warm. It gives it like 28 degrees today and it's already super warm. We've had a lion this morning which was very much needed. Um we didn't get up till like gone eight o'clock, but that was much needed. It's just it's gone ten o'clock now. But I think it's felt better than rushing out because we've both felt like so ruined. <laughs> Our feet and everything are hurting and yeah. So we're going to be checking out and heading to the park. Hi guys, this is Sophie from the future. I just thought this would be the perfect opportunity to share something really exciting with you and it's Disney related. So Wild Refill have actually very kindly sent me their new deodorant and case, which is Disney related, Disney themed, and it's for the upcoming release of a new film, The Little Mermaid, which is coming to cinemas on the 26th of May. Get it in your diaries. I am so excited. Look at this case. It's absolutely stunning. It's got Ariel's tail on it. It is gorgeous i love it so much and then they come it comes along with the deodorant refill in the scent ocean mist this scent is so stunning it's so fresh and it'll be perfect for the summer months it has like aquatic florals running through it it's like jasmine and lily and it's oh it's absolutely beautiful if you haven't heard much about wild deodorant they are vegan friendly they are sustainable no plastic in their packaging which is absolutely incredible and you can just obviously repurchase these little refills and reuse your case over and over again which will be perfect to pop in your handbag take with you on the go i have got a discount code for you guys so it is sophie disney for 20 percent off you can use that code up until the 31st of may so get your hands on it quick because it is limited edition this will definitely be become a collector's item and it's just a great way to sprinkle a little bit of Disney magic in your daily routine isn't it so I'm really excited about that I can't wait to keep using it right back to the Disney vlog <laughs> made it to IHOP which was literally like a five minute walk from our hotel amazing I can't wait for pancakes I'm definitely having pancakes this time because last time we went I got French toast so I'm definitely gonna try pancakes well, they got eggs benedict new oh you like the what have you had before um You've had an omelette, haven't you, before? Eggs Benedict looks amazing, but no, I can't. I'm here for the pancakes. I'm here for the pancakes. Here's the world famous pancakes. Oh, Cinestack. Cupcake. Ryan, they've got a cupcake one. They've got a New York cheesecake pancake. Ryan's has come out, he's got the chocolate chip, although I think he's ended up with the little chocolate chip, but he said he's not complaining about that because it smells and looks incredible. Delicious. I've ordered the cupcake pancakes, so hopefully, they'll be out very shortly. Cupcake pancakes have arrived, and um, look at the mountain of pancakes. I don't even know how we're gonna get through these, but we'll, we'll give it a good shot. So, this has got like cupcake icing and sprinkles, it's so cute. <laughs> I hope was delicious. Had the pancakes, and they were so good that ridiculously filling. We've just called in at a 7 Eleven. I had like three cups of coffee in there, so I'm 
ready for the day now. I'm waiting for that to kind of kick in the caffeine thing. Ryan picked up from 7-Eleven some little energy shop things. Yeah, that's that's it there. Um, yeah, I felt like, I was like, what's in it? And it's got ca lots of caffeine in it. I was like, I best not have one because I don't want to caffeine overload myself. What flavour is that one? Tropical burst. Tropical burst. I don't think I would like that anyway. I don't think I like the taste of it. It's a gorgeous day today. It's like, it gives it 28 or 29 and it's already toasty. This is the first day where I've come out without a jacket at all and I'm feeling very like, ooh, <laughs> feeling very excited about it. I've got all my sun cream on, packed the 50 on my face. I'm ready for the day. But we're heading on our walk down to Disney now and that's where we will remain for the rest of the day until we make our way to Hollywood, baby. And then find our Airbnb for the rest of the trip. Smell that. I can't smell, oh, I didn't smell, I didn't even smell that. It smells okay, actually. Verdict. <laughs> Get a lot on that. It's quite big, actually, isn't it? Nice? Yeah. Sure? Yeah. Woohoo! <laughs> no, I'm joking. It sounded like Vicky then. <laughs> oh boy! Oh boy! I'm ready! Instant kick! Oh, Good morning! Oh, no, that was terrible. <laughs> cut that, cut that, cut that. I'm ordering it right now! Good morning! Good morning! This was mental. We've just walked through like security and we've just been welcomed to this. We thought. You know, come on a bit later, it'll be alright. It's mental, but Ryan has just looked on Twitter. Apparently, the computers were down to let anyone in, so it's just accumulated mass crowds. But they are up and running again, they're just really slowly filtering through. We are starting off our day in the Disneyland Park, and California Adventure queues look mental. This is bad enough, but I'm grateful that we're going in this one first right that our reservation was booked for this one because if not we tackling that that's crazy oh, let's join the queue this is this isn't too bad actually all the floor the floor looks so lovely it's like this literally all the way around this area that only took like seven minutes ish so that was absolutely fine but it just looked really scary we approached all those people it's very very busy and we're not buying genie plus today we're just gonna see where the day takes us because we've ridden pretty much everything that we really wanted to there's a few little bits in there and there's some shows that ryan wants to watch in california adventure park later on today we want to do the avengers assemble, uh, assemble and doctor strange to see what that's like so there's a few things that we haven't done that we're going to do but we're just going to take it easy take it chill and not like run ourselves into the ground because that's what we've done the last two days and we've just not been <laughs> we've just been dead by the end of it so we want to really enjoy it oh look at that oh it's a big gift shop i didn't even know that was there we've been coming in through that entrance every day where it's like city hall but we've come through for the other side there's music happening marching little marching band over there how sweet it's time to conquer! Oh, oh here they come! <laughs> Show. We're just heading down Main Street now. Yeah, wh whatever you want to do, Rai. We'll chill. Is there any rides we want to go on first? If you want to have a look around the shops. Our first ride of the day is Haunted Mansion. Um, as you can see, it's mentally busy. The crowds are unbelievable today, and it is a Thursday, so 
I don't know. <laughs> I don't know what's going on, but it's so busy and it's so hot. <laughs> Main observation. This chamber has no windows and no doors. <laughs> Which offers you this chilling challenge to find a way out. <laughs> Of course, there's always my way. Yeah, the floor is changing. Can you notice the floor started to change colour? Because we're ed entering Star Wars area. I love that transition though, like just like the floor and then a few bins and then all of a sudden you're in Star Wars. <laughs> so close. Oh, rise is down again. Rise seems to go down a lot here. Um, it seems to go down a lot. Yeah, we have noticed that like a lot of rides seems to go down quite often. They do come back up, but it is quite frequent that we're like, oh yeah, that's gone down or that's gone down. It's quite regular. Here we go. I think we're gonna get a blue milk to share. It's a little refreshing drink. We're just heading around the outpost at the moment. It feels nice and air conned around this area, I'm not gonna lie. Right, checking the course back home. We're going into Smuggler's Run. We're gonna see if we can be pilots. Let's we'll see if we can fly it better than last time I was pilot, because last time I was proper crashing it. Yeah, I'm thinking. Do you have hope for me? Uh, <laughs> yeah, yeah. yeah. Maybe <laughs> waiting to go in. We are put with another group and um, they're doing the pilot. So we're engineers, which is absolutely fine. We were like the last group to join them. So we don't mind. It's going to be fun regardless. We'll see how well they fly the ship. Nothing to be afraid of yet. Just kidding. Ah, ah. <laughs> ah, a brand new flight crew. Good luck to you all. You might need it. <laughs> flight engineers, repair test. your flashing buttons. <laughs> Good job, engineer. Great. Right, pilot, push the flashing button to take off. Pilot <laughs> left. Move your stick to fly right and left. Yay. I was just about to say that. Pilot on the right. Pull back <laughs> the stick to fly out and push forward to fly down. Weapons are online. Well, we managed to get one bottle of coaxium on that one. Um, the ship was completely destroyed, wasn't it? Yeah, the pilots were. Right. The, pi the pilots, we should sack them. <laughs> it was really crashing, but it was so fun because that ride you get a different experience on it every time depending how you fly and how everyone does everything so because it was crashing so much obviously we got thrown about a lot more but it was fun um but yeah we only got one bottle and um yeah the ship was destroyed we're gonna have a little walk around here now to see if we can get a blue milk they've got ogre's cantina bar there there's a bit of a queue here we go right it is like in orlando the same layout you can get the blue milk we'll get one Bread you can get. Refreshing? Slushy. Slushy? Yeah, it is thicker. It's not like milk milk. I thought it was milk milk. No, no. It is, it's like a thicker. Yeah, it's like a thicker consistency. Is it refreshing? Can you remember what it tasted like before? No, I, I, thought, can't, I didn't think it was slushy. I can't quite remember. 
Slushy though. Mm. This way. <laughs> Your presence is requested. <laughs> don't move. <laughs> Me? No. <laughs> I've been sent over. Hello. <laughs> Here. Thank you. <laughs> Have you seen the Wookie? Who no. pilots no. the Millennium Falcon? No, no. Uh oh. They are almost as useless <laughs> as you are. I'm sorry, sir. <laughs> That's no ordinary Wookiee. <laughs> You're out of line, Trooper. Oh, yeah. And out of time. We are sorry, sir. The dark side calls. Will you turn against the light? I'm with the first one. Yeah. Understood. Good. You cannot fight your destiny. Move. <laughs> that went poorly. <laughs> that went poorly. <laughs> we had a great interaction in Star Wars with Kylo Ren and the Stormtroopers. They grabbed us forward, didn't they? <laughs> that was really funny. And the blue milk went down the street. It was super refreshing. We're now in line for Big Thunder Mountain. And yeah, it's going pretty well so far. We're heading into Fantasyland now, so we're gonna ride Mr. Toads, uh, which we've never done before, because obviously that's here and it's not a Disney World, so really looking forward to experiencing that for the first time. And look how beautiful the Disney 100 decorations are on the castle. I know I've probably shown you this in the other vlog, I can't remember what I have shown and what I haven't, but it looks stunning. The ribbons look really, really lovely on there. And then we walk through here. They got a shop in there, what's that say? Enchanted Chamber? What is that? Probably a stay room right there. Oh, uh, like an exclusive one. Yeah, right, Fantasyland's looking busy as always. We've got Sleeping Beauty Castle, what's that then? Can you go up the castle then? You, Sleeping Beauty Castle, explore darkened corridors and climb secret staircases. Do you want to have a look? Oh, this is cool. You can go up the stairs. Oh, wow. Ooh, I'm sorry. <laughs> it's dark and I couldn't see if you'd move. This is cool. It's a little story. Inside the castle, how amazing is that? Oh, there she is. A little doorway. Did you tap that and it made a noise? Oh, look, someone's walking past the skin. Oh, yeah. Oh, that made a jump. It popped up. I didn't expect that. Let me 
really glad we did that. I didn't even know it was there. So if you come through the castle and you'll see Bibbidi Bobbidi Boutique to your left, just look straight to your left behind the Sleeping Beauty castle entrance. You go through there, you can explore the staircases and that. That was really cool. Fun. That made me jump though, that little thing that popped up. I was looking what really close. <laughs> I was looking really close, it just popped up and didn't expect it. Right. I don't know that Mount Thiessen or whatever it is, it's like Maleficent or whatever it is, it's uh, basically the beauty. Oh yeah, yeah. That's Peter Pan's flight. And then Mr Toad is the next one along I think. It's a ten minute wait. of a trip are you gonna do it you're doing it the wrong way <laughs> could see ya <laughs> I can't it's not gonna happen I will. Oh. <laughs> well maybe it doesn't matter which way <laughs> See what the wait time's like for Pinocchio's journey. now into Tomorrowland so we're gonna go ride Space Mountain for the last time and then I think we're gonna do Autopia after which is the cars because we've not done that yet yet this trip I don't know what all these people are queuing for here all oh, right they are queuing for the Alice in Wonderland bit there's the Alice in Wonderland ride and the Alice in Wonderland walkthrough bit as well isn't there oh they are they queuing for Astro Blasters ah. I feel, I never know, like, the queues stretch out so far, I never know what's for what. Face was great as always, and we've got a funny face, so I'll insert our photo pass picture now. 
we're in the queue for Autopia. We haven't ridden this this trip, so we thought, why not? We've got time to do that, and then I think after that, we're gonna head down Main Street into a few shops, and then we're gonna park hop over to Disney California Adventure. Bit cramped. It, it, yeah, there's not, it's not like oodles of room in here, is there? We've got two backpacks. It's all right. Off we go. It says, do not bump the car in front. Go, go, go! I like this. I'm just chilling. Five, four, three, two, one, go, 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 go. <laughs> oh, this is nice. It turns better than the Orlando one. Oh, does it? See, that's what I was fearing of, and I didn't want to drive right, because. If I just leave it, the taxi car. Oh, it doesn't slow. even bump. Yeah. Yeah, but not like. <laughs> see ya, see ya. I am. This is a nice little track, isn't it? Not a lot of room though. No, yeah, I know, but we've got two big backpacks there. Like, I prefer this track to the Orlando one. What? Shading. Yeah. It, well, shading, but I feel like it has more levels. And, I don't know. I just prefer this track. I think there's more to it. Oh, let me slow down. I'm into the Christmas shop and it's really really cute in here. Yeah? Oh wow! He's so cool, it's a silly nutcracker. We've got Oogie Boogie there as well. It always feels weird looking at Christmas stuff like this time of year. I love these. I see that saw these last year on uh, Shop Disney. Really sweet. Oh, and I saw like these. We've come into a shop and Ryan has picked this up. Is it just like is it a pizza plate yeah. and the pizza knife? Yeah. <laughs> How much? <laughs> Only for that's not bad for a big plate could to be we get fair. That back safely though. I think so, yeah. We could just completely wrap it in cloves. But you'd have to come back for it later. 14 inch as well. Yeah. Sorry. I like the cups. We've got like churras. I think I saw them the other night. I think they're candles. And then they've got all the hand soaps there as well. It's quite busy in here. Are these like notebooks. Look how cute this little area is in between like some of the shops. We've got all the little flowers and some seat in here. How sweet. We're just delving into shop to shop and it's really nice for the aircon, I'm not gonna lie. But we're making our way up Main Street um, on our way to the other park. It's a little admission section for Steamboat Willie. It's like old, old school theatre. Yeah, one please. Thank you. Oh, look at this. This is adorable. How cute is this? I'm going to pop into this one as well. Oh, these are fun. Please. Got lots of magic bits in here. Cards. The magic instructions. Oh, look at these. Hi, good, good thank, thank you. you. <laughs> so much Disney 100 stuff everywhere. Oh, I like the little ornaments. That's really sweet. $12.99. That's not too bad actually. That isn't badly priced. I thought that was going to be a crazy amount. $12.99. I'm guessing Mini will be. Yeah, of course. Mini is the same. How cute. Ryan's grabbing spirit jersey. He's getting this one, the plain black one, which is really, really lovely. I think this is. don't know how much it is. It doesn't have a price. They're usually like $70, I think. Something around there. Let's get the Disneyland. We've just come into this little area and it's got all of old photographs. Look at that photograph of Walt looking through the castle. The actual park bench from the Griffith Park merry-go-round in Los Angeles where Walt Disney first dreamed of Disneyland. Oh my god, stop. 
That's that's cute. Oh, how lovely. Walt's Disney Dream. Oh, is this like a little area with all like the photographs and stuff and Oh I like I like areas like this. It's always nice to discover them, isn't it? Look at these. Pinocchio. 1983. <laughs> it's got all like some original sketches by the look of it over there. Oh, look. Wow, and you can see how the sketch forms for the animator's desk. Now it ended up into the gallery, the Disney gallery, and look how many beautiful pieces of artwork there is. So many different styles. I oh my goodness, I absolutely love that. 399. I've got some sketches here. Oh, how amazing are these? Oh, look at Max. Goofy. What loads? Got Figment, an orange bird. Park icon sketches. <laughs> There's some more beautiful pieces over here. This is amazing. Oh, I love that. It's $199. Limited edition print. I love that. Oh, and I love the style of some of these. Oh, the Muppet Show. They've got Mickey and friends on the Indiana Jones ride. <laughs> say bye to the castle because we're gonna park hop over to the other one and then that's, that's our last day we've had a great three three days though i feel like three days is like more than enough isn't it to do everything we, we did everything really what we wanted to we did some extras today in the two days but obviously we've been able to do a few little fantasy land extras but i'm gonna say bye to the castle now which is actually really sad and um on camera, I don't know if you can see it. There we go, there she is, looking all pretty. People getting pictures with the little Mickey statue there. By Disneyland Castle. Thanks for the best time, it's been amazing. Right, on to the next park, the last leg of the journey before our drive to Hollywood. We've come into the other park and we've come straight to the Avengers campus because we're waiting for the Doctor Strange show. We missed it yesterday because we jumped in line and then we got told that we would have to stand and we were like, do we want to? Our feet were problems. So we were like, let's try and do it tomorrow. So we come out right here. We sat on the floor waiting in the queue. We did get here like 30 minutes earlier, so we were like, we will, we will see the show. We did miss the Avengers Assemble, but Ryan said he's not too good and he'll just have to watch it on YouTube, which is pretty sad, but hey ho, and we have got we are going to ride guardians of the galaxy a little while after so we're going to spend some time in the avengers area again which is fun and i have got changed i am that person <laughs> i was like i'm gonna wear my other t-shirt i just oh, i had loads of outfits in mine and i was like i'm bringing it with me i'm doing a quick change in the toilet so that's what it is that person and we're snacking on some goofy sweet are they goofy sweet blueberry sweets rainbow sticks they're really tasty but they're pretty chewy and it gets to more teeth with them I recommend they're good Mission 
breakout was fantastic. We got a different song this time, so I think you get different songs and it goes up and down to like the beat of the song. This one was even better than yesterday's. We thoroughly enjoyed it and everyone was dancing. It was so it was good. Jackson 5. But, yeah, it was Jackson 5. It was so good. And when I say everyone was dancing, obviously in their seat, like we were all like boogieing. <laughs> it was really good. We met Captain America. That was really nice. Just had some nice pictures on the Pixar Pier and we're just kind of heading over there to Incredicoaster now and then um, I think we're going to grab some food from the little food and wine festival booths. That's the plan. Um, I will show you later. Ryan got a rocket which was basically, you know them squishy plush say toys and big plushes that are like basically like pillows and proper squishy he ended up getting a rocket so I mean I'm gonna be definitely making use of him as well he's so soft so that's fun yeah want a snow cone adorable frosted treats <laughs> I just love all the theming and everything around here oh it's off ready go 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 that'll be us in very shortly it's going it's going it's fine go 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 Woohoo! We've ridden it, it was so good. My eyes were like streaming all the way around, but I managed to keep my hands up throughout the whole of that one, even during the loopy loop, which is unheard of for me. Usually I'm gripping on, but I just felt like, yeah, I was just living my living best life. You you had your arms up all the way around with it, didn't you? We were both just like, ah! it was so good. Highly recommend if you love roller coasters. It's really fun and incredible themes, obviously. We're just doing a final little lap around the pier now. Just taking in all the scenery before we get some food, head into the shops and then make our way out of Disney. But the adventures don't stop here. We've still got a time in LA. We're gonna head to Hollywood. We've got Universal plans. We've got Warner Bros. Studio tour plans. So we've still got lots of fun stuff. And I wanted to eat so many things here, but as a runner, I've got not, not got enough bellies. I'm still not eating anything except for those pancakes today. They just filled me up. And Brian, like we've not eaten anything out, so I want to just get something small from the the food stands. But yeah, I, I could probably go without eating for the rest of the day, but I kind of want to try something. So there's a mac and cheese that I've been eyeing up. I might grab one of them. Here he is. He's okay. He survived the roller coaster in the bag. Rocket <laughs> in the bag he goes. So it's suffocating. <laughs> sleeping. He's sleeping. Yeah, he's gone to sleep. He's having a nap. Yeah. I might be grabbing something from this store, Cuckoo Doodle Moo. I reckon he's going for the barbecue beef brisket slider. I feel like he's gonna go for the slider. These are what's on the menu here. That's right, he went for the slider. That looks really nice. Let's go find a, um, a table or something or somewhere for you to eat it. You sure? Sure? Yeah. Okay. Hello. It's later now. We've left Disney, we've said our goodbyes, it was so sad, but sorry I haven't uh, picked up the camera in a little while. All we did was um, eat, I think I showed Ryan's little, what was it, a burger? Yeah, it was like a little slider, slider, wasn't it? Yeah, that was it. Beef and brisket slider. That was it, beef brisket slider. I grabbed mac and cheese and I ate it that quick, I don't think I even showed you it. <laughs> it was it was really nice actually, it was, a, it was a good portion of mac and cheese, it was lovely. Um, then we just literally nipped into the jump shops and picked up some bits that we wanted um, I might do a little haul video with all our stuff so I will say I'll save that for a little video but we walked back to the car we said bye to Disney we've had the best time and Ryan is very kindly driving us to downtown LA and um, yeah I'll show you in a second a little clip of everything because it looks incredible it's all so built up um, through downtown LA. Yeah, we're actually driving through downtown LA. We're 16 minutes away from Airbnb. Um, all been smooth so far. You've been okay, haven't you? Mm -hmm. It's all been fine and dandy. Um, so yeah, 15 minutes to go. We'll arrive about 10 to 9. Um, we left Disney about 20 plus? No, it was 20 to 8, wasn't it? When we left Disney, we walked back to our car because we left the car parked at like the hotel. They let us leave the car there for the day, so we went back little walk back 
and then it's been about a 45 minute drive because there's not been that much traffic like in here not like in rush hour rush hour can be like an hour and a half back up to something like that but yeah i'm looking forward to seeing like our little airbnb setup and at least we can properly unpack then for the rest of the stay so we have like what day is it we've got seven days we're leaving in seven days time so it's a good amount of time then not to look Cause I got some good news for you Unexpected surprise Now you're on the hook Guess what I booked a ticket for two We've made it to our Airbnb and I will give you a little tour around. Ryan is in the shower at the room at the moment so I'll show you that after he's out but it's so nice. So we've just come in and we had a little private entrance so it's called like the guest house. I'll leave like the details in the description below on Airbnb um, just in case anyone wants to book with them but it was beautiful. So we've come in and it's hang on it's not focusing there we go we've come in and it's this gorgeous like massive bedroom but obviously it's like a guest house so we've got a lovely chair here we've got lots of space for our suitcases we need to we've literally just walked in and dumped everything lovely artwork on the wall we've got chair bedside table beautiful big bed we've got a ladder up there and i will show you up there but i can't work out how to turn the light on up there yet so i might have to show you in the morning again properly when it's like a bit lighter but then i turn around we've got a massive tv and a big like stand here for storage and things and then over here we've got like a big table and chairs some lovely artwork on the wall and then behind the curtain we've got this massive like kitchen area it's like huge well i'd say it's huge it's really long something that obviously we knew we were going to have in here but it's like it's bonus because obviously we would usually stay in a hotel room with just like a little maybe a little side like we had in the last place with a fridge but this is really ideal that we've got this if we need it but we've got what, pots and pans i don't even know even been in oh yeah so we've got things to use oh it says light switch oh ah there you go a little light in the kitchen Oh, I'm a little nosy. I've not been in any of the cupboards yet. This is great. I'm just, I'm just literally nosying around. Mugs, cafetiere. Oh, I've got coffee in there. Fabulous. Oh, Ryan, I'd be happy with that. We've got daily vitamin C immune support thing there. Oh, we've got a bedtime brew. Lovely. Massive sink. And then I will show you quickly upstairs. This is the view from this route, this point of view. Love the flooring and the rugs, they're so nice. Let's take you up the stairs. It's really cute. Oh, look at it, I love it. I'm trying to be careful with this ladder. Ooh. So over here, like I said, I can't quite work out how to turn this light on. But we've got a massive bean bag here and cushions. Sorry, my camera is literally having a meltdown focusing these days. It's got little cushions and art prints over there. It's, it's going out of focus again. It's having a meltdown, I'm so sorry. And we've got a massive bean bag here. And then we've got like art print on the wall, and some little decor pieces, but it's just like a little chill area. So cute. And um, we've got an outdoor patio. It's all built up in the hills, so we've got like a little table and chair set up outside. Um, I'm gonna get down the ladder and then I'll show you the bathroom. Right, we're back downstairs, after getting down the stairs. And in here we've got the shower room. I love the tiles on the floor, it's really fun. We've got obviously toilet, sink. And we've got, I'm really happy about this, we've got a bath and a shower. I have been dreaming about a bath for the last few days just to soak my feet and lay in it after a nightgreen day at the park. Hello! I am absolutely done in but I'm so pleased we're here. It's so lovely and then in here we've got a massive store cupboard for all like our clothes and they've got some hangers which is perfect but there's so much space so we can put all of this. We've got little hooks on the wall, we've got an iron. Hair dryer will definitely come in handy. But yeah, the fact we've got like this walk-in cupboard situation, we can put the suitcases in here as well where I have to actually. That'll probably be handy. Yeah, the 
turn the light off now. But yeah. And there's a full length mirror on the wall here as well, which is great. I'm so impressed. This is amazing. I love it. I'm loving the artwork on the walls, especially. But yeah, I think I'm going to end this vlog here, actually. And I will catch up with you tomorrow morning. I can show you bits outside as well when it's daylight. We're just going to unpack now and uh, settle in, ready for our first day in Los Angeles. How exciting. I will see you all in the next one. Bye. Cause we're right.